seven, eight, take three. Daryl and Laura and I sat down and uh, Gary Parisi, our sound guy, sat down a week prior um, and had an idea of what we wanted to do. I was hoping for hip hopper. And when I drew I Love Blank Sitcom, What are we going to do, Ralphie? Daryl said, Go for it. And so I went for it. A hip hop star in a sitcom situation. And the name, of course, was perfect Camel Otterboy. And that's Otterboy. And so our hip hop star was Camel Otterboy, and our film was I Love Camel. One of the things about uh, the directing is you want everybody to like you, and it's not easy to get that to happen. As a matter of fact, I believe it's impossible, especially in a 48-hour gig where um, tensions are high. This ain't working, man. This ain't working, man. You're having to snap, snap, snap. I had a guy that could write a beat in no time, and so as soon as we had our genre and wrote our story, this is what I put together. Um, and it was a real catchy tune, and um, Rod Phillips, he ran with it, we gave him the lyrics, and he was a perfect combo on a boy, and a real good nice. get through it all lots of coffee and lots of tums probably the biggest challenge for me was acting I had not acted before and except in school plays which was like eons ago um, but I had a line uh, you're the shiznit you're the shiznit a hip hop term, and I had the toughest time with shiznit. Um, try saying you're the shiznit ten times. Shiznit, 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 shiznit. I want to especially thank um, Daryl Parker and Laura Tapia for helping me pull this off, and a big thanks to Rob Tillich. Um, whole uh, crew, uh, Rob Sanchez, our DP, and uh, especially um, to Jillian Kenyon, who not only filled in a vital role um, when our one of our actresses pulled out, uh, but she also helped me with writing hip hop lyrics, and uh, I learned a lot about hip hop terminology through Jillian. All in all, would I do it again? You better believe I would. It was a challenge. It, we had fun. Um, a lot of people learned a lot. And I say congratulations to all those that participated in this year's 48-hour film competition for the Sacramento International Film Festival. And I look forward to participating again next year.